Hi, welcome to Norton Hall. In 1927, the founding fathers of Norton hired Arthur Covey to paint a number of murals on the walls of this hall. This large ornamental tree painted at the front of the hall represents the founding of Norton Company. The roots of the tree are represented by the seven men, the original investors in 1885 of the Norton Emery Wheel Company. And you can see up through the trunk, the major acquisitions and expansions that we had throughout the years. If you look almost to the top, you'll see Bear Manning in 1931. That was our entrance into the sandpaper business. Above that, Norton Pike, our entrance into the cutting stone business. If we look at the horns of plenty on the tree, they represent the rich fruits of our concerted effort. And up the sides, there are torches, which represent the everlasting quality that the people gave to Norton Company. The tree itself is composed of a number of names that you'll see. And what they represent is any worker who gave 25 years to Norton Company. You'll see these names filled the entire tree and then we filled all of the panels along the walls around the entire room. On the back walls, you'll notice two golden panels. And those are our employees who gave the ultimate sacrifice serving their country. The murals in this room represent the original process to build a grinding wheel, starting with the mining of bauxite, which would be fired into aluminum oxide to be used as the grain. Here's the firing process for the bauxite to make aluminum oxide. And then we move into mixing, where we mix the abrasive grain with bonds. After the mixing, we did the pressing of the wheels into shape. And following that, we move them into the kiln, which is depicted here. After the firing of the grinding wheels, we'd move into fin finishing, where we cut the bores, the faces, and the peripheries of the grinding wheels into size, shape, and made sure they, they ran concentric, concentric. Following that was shipping, and originally we used wooden barrels with sawdust to pack the grinding wheels in, which is depicted here. And then the last photo shows our wheels being used in industry. In this case, on a cylindrical grinder, and you can see the line shaft machines of the original factories back in the day, which we shipped to. I hope you've enjoyed this tour and the glimpse into the past history of Norton Company. This hall represents our greatest asset, our people. If you're ever in Worcester, please feel free to give us a call for a personal tour and thank you for the business.